I wanted to give a big shout out to Back to the Future 99. This is my eight brother who not only understands the V for Victory project, but, you know, he comes to all my live streams, or, you know, the majority of them when he when he's able to make it. He always supports me with Super Chats. And he, he said something that was beautiful. He said, hey, father, the movement, the eight movement is not over. He says, we, we need to all reunite. Reunited and it feels so good. <laughs> You're probably like, what? That's a great song, but that's an old, that's an oldie, but a goodie. Um, we need to get reorganized. We need to get all of our apes from all around the world back into the movement, but it's going to be back into what's called the V for victory movement. And let me tell you what the plan is. If you ever watched the, uh, the movie Planet of the Apes with Mark Wahlberg, he had the uh, monkey that was in the lab that he sent the monkey into space. The monkey's name was Simos. Okay, so <laughs> let me explain to you. Simos was the monkey that went into planet Earth, I guess it was in the future, and saw the, the revolution of the apes taking over, you know, the whole world. Okay, that's kind of, I want you to make me Simos, and then you're going to shoot me to Las Vegas. I want to enter a new industry. The stock market could kiss my ass. You understand? F the stock market. F Ken Griffin, F Gary Gensler, and F Adam friggin' Enron. F all those friggin' Mabalukes, those friggin' cockroaches, okay? I'll bury those motherfuckers, Scarface. <laughs> Entertainment purposes only. Like, really? Is he gonna do that? Entertainment purposes only. But seriously, I'm very angry. That's, that's for real. And the greatest revenge, you wanna know what the greatest revenge is? Is making more effing money than these motherfuckers. And I know you think it's not possible. You're like, hey, father, how do you ever think you're going to make more money than Ken Griffin? It's very simple. We lost, I hate to bring this up, but it's it bears repeating. Retail lost $350 billion in 2022. That's a lot of effing money. That's not a small amount of money. You're talking more money than Elon Musk has. That is a lot of effing money. You know that money was squandered to nothing, to zero. To nothing. It was like we just gave it to the hedge funds. We gave it to the short sellers. If that money, just again, this is for entertainment purposes only, but I just want you to think about this, was actually invested in casinos, we could add a dynasty. A dynasty. You could have had a hundred casinos in the in the most the best parts of the world. Macau, Las Vegas, everywhere. Generating probably a hundred billion dollars a year. Okay, but instead, we took $350 billion, we wiped our ass with it, we squandered it to zero. Now, I'm trying to make all of you understand the movement part was correct. All of us getting together was correct. That was smart. We were apes together strong. We were all together, but it was the wrong effing industry. We did it in the stock market. I want to change the industries to the casino industry, but this is the thing. It doesn't make sense right now for me to ask people for investments. It doesn't make sense because first of all, nobody knows me. I don't have a track record of success. When you put together any type of an offering, you have to try to understand, you have to deal majority with accredited investors. These are people who make like a quarter of a million a year, have a net worth of a million dollars. There's no way accredited investors are going to invest in me. They're going to say, look at this Italian meatball. They're going to say, what, what, what have you done? What have you done for me lately? Ooh, yeah. They're not going to do it, okay? So I have a different plan. What my plan is, is let me finance the first project. Let me open the first casino. Now, how do I plan to do this? It's a two-step process. I want to use my own money. I want to use my own earned income. What is earned income? Money I make from YouTube ad revenue. And money I make from, you know, the extra revenue, which is like super stickers, super chats. Again, this is tips. This is not an investment. Don't ever confuse it. It's not a donation. I'm not a not-for-profit company. These are tips for entertainment purposes only. But it, it's a part of my income. It's a part of my earned income. If enough apes would reunite and come to the live streams and we could start this movement again because it's not dead. We got to bring it alive again. And you could help me be Simos, the first ape to enter the casino industry on my own. Then I promise down the line, 
to meet with a very prestigious securities firm, make sure that everything is going to be regulated, that the SEC has to approve everything first and foremost. And then down the line, I might be able to do an offering for all of my eight brothers and eight sisters to get involved in like project number two, project number three, in terms of the casino industry, baby. Okay. So it all starts from coming to my live stream. That's step one trying to spread the word Officer Bird. I want every ape worldwide to hear this message. I call it the V for Victory Project. Apes together strong, apes reuniting, apes getting organized once again, keeping the movement alive, but in a different industry, the casino industry. And not just real property, online casinos, sports betting, just like DraftKings, baby. Big time money, hundreds and hundreds of billions of dollars I mean, this is big time, okay? This is where they, they say the house always wins. Well, I want to be the house. Come to my live streams. Let's talk about it. This video is not financial advice. I'm not a financial planner. This video is for entertainment purposes only. V for victory.